Not very often do you get a chance to see a first ballot Hall of Famer, but Miguel Cabrera, I'd say, a shoe in for that position. Yeah, one of the best right handed hitters of all time, and maybe, you know, the best I've seen in my career. Colin Ray with an opportunity to shine tonight in his debut here at American Family Field. He's a sinker specialist. But do a ground ball to short. Terang immediately tested. Makes a nice play for out number one. Boy, he's a slick fielding middle infielder, whether he's at second or at short. He's going to have to get rid of the ball a little quicker over at shortstop tonight. Got that one out of the way at shortstop. He's been a lot more patient during this eight game hitting streak. Yeah, he sure has. Now he's in a good hitter's count. Looking for his first home run of the year, he'll take the walk. And he's aboard with two away here in the first. Here's Nick Maton. Lays down a bunt. That's a beauty. That's how you get out of a slump. Yes, right there. it is. Maton's been going through it. There's no doubt about it. And we're having a tough time seeing the ball. This is exactly what you do. And you got the speed that Maton has. Lay the base, lay it down. 2 2 pitch. There's a strikeout to end the inning. And at the end of one half inning of play, Detroit, nothing. Milwaukee coming up. Brewers facing the 32 year old native of Mercer Island in Washington, Matthew Boyd. The 1 2. Swing and a miss. How about that? 94 up and away with some life to get Brasso. Willie Adamas is going to get the night at DH. His first time this year as the DH. Strike three called, and Adamas knew it. Two men are out here, opening inning. Nothing, nothing game. The pitch hit in the air to center and deep. Hey, get up! Get out of here! Gone for Contreras. There's number one on the air. Finally, in game number 23 for William. And the Brewers have the lead at 1 0. Yes, indeed. The wedge fits him. First time he's been able to wear that. I think he's still trying to get that. That feel and good rhythm on the mound. Fastball swing and a miss. And that is a power fastball swing and miss fastball in the first. First at bat of the series for Miguel Cabrera. Final trip to Milwaukee. One of the game's all time greats. Here's the 2 1. Ground ball to third. Brousseau had to back up. Double play. Two outs, bases empty. One nothing Brewers are in the second. Eric Haas draws a walk to lead off the Tigers' third. Runner goes. It's a strike throw to second base on the bag. What a pick by Terang to get the out. Well, he's impressive, isn't he? Bryce Terang, no matter where he's playing, second or short. A yeah, good pick, good quick release from William Contreras from his knees. The 3 2 outside. So back to back walks, but first runner cut down attempting to steal. And by the way, great pickup by the shortstop. There he goes. Inside Green draws a walk. Three walks in the inning. First and second for Javier Baez. A 3 1 first pitch line drive. Basing into right field. The kill Badu is going to be held at third. Gary Jones waved in there and then held him. The throw comes in from right. Oh man. Riley Green is caught between second and third. He actually slid into third base. Oh my goodness. I'm watching the throw home. Badu's retreating to third, and then I see Riley Green sliding headfirst into third, and the Tigers are running themselves right out of an inning. Three walks and a single in the inning, but there are two outs. Here's Nick Maton. Maton with a bomb. Deep right field. See you later. A three-run shot. That'll make up for it. Tigers have the lead. That was launched. Mayton's team leading fourth home run of the season. Talk about picking up your teammates. Perkins, a right handed batter, swings and misses at a fastball up and in. Another strikeout for Boyd as Bryce Terang goes down swinging. And suddenly Matthew Boyd has five punch outs. So two down and nobody on for Brasso. As Brasso tries center field, back is Green onto the warning track. It is gone. Brasso goes deep. Brasso hits his third of the season, and the Brewers within a run. It's three to two. First time that Brasso gets to wear the cheese here at home. And another strikeout for Matthew Boyd. Give him six on the night. It's a 3 2 Tigers lead as we head to the fourth for Milwaukee. Boyd looks over at first. Here's the pitch. Breaking ball hit off the glove of Boyd and on into center field. It's a base hit for Anderson. Contreras will stop at second, and the Brewers have something cooking here in this bottom of the fourth. Boyd got a glove on that. It wasn't going to matter. That was going to be a base hit regardless. 
It was a big curveball, and Anderson hit it off the end of the bat right back up the middle. Payoff coming here. Swing and a miss. Got him in the fastball. Beat him inside. Good pitch right there, Matthew Boyd. I called for the changeup. They went with a heater right on the inside third. Miller, slow roller up the third baseline. That's going to be a base hit. Second life for Miller. Cashes in. Bases loaded for Weimer. Got him. Eighth strikeout for Matthew Boyd, and all on fastballs, most swinging. A line drive to left. Unable to come up with it. Blake Perkins. Haas will hustle for two, and a pop up slide gets him in there. Looking for a hole instead, a diving st stop made by Owen Miller, and he throws him out. Haas moves up 90 feet. Well, it's a good at bat by Badu, and it's an even better play by Miller over at second base. Eric Haas is at third with one out. 3 2 Tigers are in the fifth. Green with a chopper to second. They'll come home, and they will not get him. Eric Haas with a great slide to beat the throw, and the Tigers are up 4-2. You want to hit a fly ball and not make this close, but take a look at Eric Haas's slide here to the back of the base, little pop-up slide, and he gets in easy. The 0-2, sharply to short for Baez. Easy four south inning is over. There goes McKinstry again. Haas strikes out, the throw down to second, in time to get a swimming Zach McKinstry. See if the Tigers want to check it. They do. You can see right here where McKinstry, that left hand, you see him pull that left hand back, avoiding the tag, and going to the back side of the bag. Boy, that's a great slide. After review, the call on the field is overturned. The runner is safe. Detroit will contain their challenge. There you go. Struck him out. Fastball in the inside corner. Wilson needed four extra pitches. Lifted right center field. Veerling calls for it and hauls it in. Sits him down. Down three. Oh, and the count. Alex Lang comes right back and brushes him aside. Two away. Book it. He went, and Lang strikes out the last two hitters he faces for his second save and snaps the Tigers' four-game losing streak. Brewers dropped the opener against Detroit by a final of 4-2. to two. First time all season they've lost consecutive games.